Hi there, I'm Miriam and welcome to Miriam's Manor. So today I put together a really quick video for you guys to show you my 2021 4th of July tablescape. So like I do every year with seasonal decor, I always check my stash closet first to see what I have that I can reuse and repurpose in a new way. So this year is no different. Most of the stuff on this table are items that I already owned. I only did one DIY project for this table and that was for the placemat. So if you didn't see the video that I released a couple of days ago showing you how to make these placemats, definitely check that out after you watch this one. And I hope this offers you some inspiration on how to decorate your table for this 4th of July. So check it out and let me know what you think. Starting with my blank table, I will first add a wide red runner. Next, I am adding a thinner white runner down the center of that one. I will add my center pieces next, starting with my tall glass face with red, white, and blue hydrangeas. I am adding candles to this table, so I am cutting wax circles to set the candles on so that the wax blue residue does not stain my white runner. So now that my circles are cut, I can add these candles to the table and I am putting the hurricane faces over them. Now I am adding this heart shaped wreath to the table. I have two of these and I am placing them on both sides of the hurricane faces. Next, I set white lanterns on the inside of the wreath with small flags in them. The center pieces are done, so now it's time to add the dishware. And I am beginning with these festive placemats that I made last week. I then add the charger plate, and next the dinner plate, then the salad plate, the napkins, and last but not least, I add these cobalt blue water goblets and now the table is complete. So I hope this does offer some inspiration to you guys on how to create a 4th of July tablescape for your home and maybe just using things that you have lying around your house as well. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Also, please subscribe to my channel, share the video, and click on that notification bell so that you don't miss any new videos that I release. As always, if you guys have any questions for me, please leave me a line in the comment section and I will get back with you. And until I see you again, stay safe, God bless you, and happy 4th of July. Bye.